Hello today's video we have the following content. 0.39 year old Tang Yan plays a girl again. The new drama Nian Wushan was exposed and ridiculed, netizens, Mijushi Tai. Recently, the Reuters photos of Tang Yan's new drama Nian Wushan were exposed. The white clothes looked too plain. Even the makeup looked particularly casual. As soon as such Reuters photos came out, Tang Yan's fans were not happy. They protested on the internet. Maybe the movement on the internet was really big. Later, Tang Yan's dress seemed to be better. This time in red, Tang Yan looked much better. Everyone knows that Tang Yan has basically not been in the crew since she gave birth to a child in 2020. In the middle, she participated in the movie Fang Hua, and it was only a third role. Everyone is looking forward to Tang Yan's comeback. Unexpectedly, she chose a fairy tale drama to come back. This time, Nian Wushong has not been broadcast yet, and it has been ridiculed for flop. So can Tang Yang come back with Nian Wushong this time? There's a reason why everyone is looking forward to Tang Yan's fairy tale drama. After all, she is a typical representative of the 85 flowers in the entertainment industry. Recently, except Zhao Liying, other people in the 85 flowers are acting in fairy tale dramas. And her most famous representative work is Zhuan. Back then, Zhuan and Purple moved countless people. Her love with Su Changking for three lives and three worlds made countless people cry. Even many people think that this is the best role Tang Yan has ever played. This is not only the peak moment of her acting skills, but also the peak moment of her appearance. Unfortunately, since then, she has been immersed in the world of silly and sweet and can't get out. Whether it is Cheyenne Wei and the three daughters of the Xia family Ali Uzia Obi and Love wakes up. They are all the standard silly and sweet settings. However, the audience at that time was not deeply influenced by silly and sweet. I still like to watch this kind of idol drama. Tang Yan successfully made herself known to everyone through these silly and sweet roles. She successfully joined the team of 85 Flowers. Speaking of the 85 Flowers at that time, we have to talk about the disputes between her and her then good friend Yang Mi. She became good friends with Yang Mi after she met her on the set of Legend of Sword and Fairy 3. At that time, everyone thought they were good girlfriends in the entertainment industry. In 2014, Yang Mi held her wedding. Tang Yan was the only bridesmaid present. But how could two people with such a close relationship go their separate ways in the end? Perhaps it was due to a conflict of interest. At that time, she participated in the TV version of Y Shang Ziyamo. Then, Yang Mi's movie version was scheduled. Playing the same role, it is inevitable that they will be compared with each other. This caused a rift between the two. But this is not the most fatal thing at all. In order to gain a foothold in the capital circle, Yang Mi signed a gambling agreement in 2014. She had to earn 300 million inches three years. Therefore, Yang Mi took on many roles and signed many artists in these three years. The most famous one among them is Delia Reba. In the TV series Diamond Lover, Delia Reba, who had just debuted, played a supporting role for Tang Yan. But it was Delia Reba who became popular. At that time, there were articles everywhere comparing the acting skills of the two and belittling each other. Tang Yan was said to be nothing. Think about the company that issued the article, maybe it was Jiaxing Media, which was headed by Yang Mi. In the entertainment industry, it is very common for female stars to compete for resources. I don't know if it was because of the competition for these resources that caused the two to have a gap. But later, the two of them rarely appeared in the same picture together. It seemed that there was no friendship between the two. But compared with Yang Mi's messy marriage, Tang Yan's marriage is really happy. In 2016, Luo Jin confessed his love to her on Weibo. She also replied very straightforwardly, so it's you. Their relationship is public. Since the two officially announced their relationship, they have been keeping a low profile. But their sweetness can't be hidden at all. When the two participated in the show together, their auras matched each other very well. When Luo Jin looked at her, his eyes were full of love. In 2018, two years after the official announcement of their relationship, the two officially got married. Luo Jin held a romantic wedding for her. Tang Yan smiled so brightly at the wedding. Now the two have been married for almost five years. But the relationship between the two is still the same as at the beginning, and they are a model couple in the entertainment industry. Facts show that Luo Jin is a good man that people can entrust their lives to. But at the beginning, the silly and sweet girl did not choose Luo Jin. When they were filming Gone with the Wind in 2011, Tang Yan's boyfriend was still the scumbag Qiu Yuzhe. Qiu Yuzhe is a famous playboy in the Taiwanese entertainment industry. 
After confirming that he and Tang Yan were in a boyfriend-girlfriend relationship, he actually flirted with other female stars. Even Tang Yan behaved extremely humbly in this relationship. Who could have expected that Tang Yan would travel all the way to Taiwan to take care of him and help him clean the house? Some media even revealed that she actually cleaned the toilet for him. But everything she did did not make her boyfriend feel sorry for her. He never thought about making his relationship with Tang Yan public. It was not until the paparazzi took photos of each other in his car that their relationship was exposed. If only one party is giving in a relationship, it will definitely not last long. Not long after, the two decided to separate. After the breakup, Tang Yan's condition was quite bad. At that time, some media actually took photos of her with a wound on her wrist. But fortunately, she met Luo Jin not long after. Since Gone with the Wind, she and Luo Jin have actually collaborated on a full five dramas. In the process of running in one drama after another, she slowly realized that Luo Jin was very outstanding. Although Luo Jin is not as famous as her, he always takes care of her on the scene. When filming X-Men, they had a lot of fighting scenes. When fighting with her, Luo Jin was always cautious. But once, she was injured while filming other scenes. Luo Jin was very anxious and went out to buy her medicine immediately. After she broke up with Qiuza, they got closer and closer, and finally became boyfriend and girlfriend. Before Tang Yan, he had another relationship. When he was filming the TV series Mu Gine Takes Command, he fell in love with this drama. He fell in love with Mia Pu, who was four years older than him. But the parents of both sides were not optimistic about the sister-brother relationship. His family thought that Mia Pu was four years older than him, which was too inappropriate. Mia Pu's family thought that his career was not developing well. This hit his self-esteem. He once said to Mia Pu in person, Do your family look down on me? Mia Pu did not respond to him in person at the time, but what she did later showed everything. When Mia Pu's father was ill, Mia Pu couldn't come back for a while, so he went to the hospital to take care of her father. But at this time, Mia Pu met the wealthy businessman Chen Yi Hung outside. The two slowly got together. His relationship with Mia Pu also ended. So before dating Tang Yan, he and Tang Yan had just come out of the pain of their relationship. Perhaps because of this, they cherish each other more. The facts show that these two people are really the companions in each other's lives. Tang Yan is particularly willing to give up part of her work for the family. After Tang Yan had a daughter in 2020, the pace of her acting career slowed down. In addition to a small amount of work, she spends most of her time at home with her child. Children grow up so fast, so you have to spend more time with her. Tang Yan said in an interview. And in a previous interview, Tang Yan said that she is very traditional. If you get married, it's best not to divorce, so that you can create a particularly good growth environment for your child. Now, the beautiful family she longed for has become a reality. The Reuters photos of the new drama have come out recently. Although some people are not optimistic, Luo Jin is definitely the number one fan of this drama. During the filming, Luo Jin visited the crew several times. He also bought milk tea for everyone in the middle. In addition to visiting the crew, Luo Jin also video chatted with his wife and daughter many times during filming. It seems that their family of three lives a happy life. Tang Yan's career and love are both very good now, and she has finally made it. After all, Tang Yan's journey has not been easy. She was born in an ordinary family in Shanghai. Then, she was admitted to the Central Academy of Drama Smoothly. While in school, she was actually selected by Zhang Yimao to become an Olympic baby. There was a performance of Jasmine in Beijing eight minutes at the Athens Olympics. Originally, I thought her future would be smooth after graduation. However, the result was not what I wanted. In the first year after graduation, she only filmed one drama. It was not easy to sign a company, but the company sent her to Hong Kong for development. And the path she took in Hong Kong was not suitable for her at all. She participated in many dramas directed by Wang Jing. There was even a sex scene with Zhang Hui in one of them. This situation continued for several years. Perhaps when Tang Yan was about to give up, she met her current agent. Now her agent led her back to the mainland to seek development. After returning to the mainland, she took the script of Legend of Sword and Fairy 3. From then on, her star journey finally took a turn. Although she played many silly and sweet roles after becoming famous. However, Tang Yan has been in the industry for many years and does not have any substantial bad habits. Compared with those stars who evaded taxes, Tang Yan does not have so many things. She has a very Buddhist personality. Perhaps many people will ask, 
Why can Tang Yan not leave ancient idol dramas? However, at present, many of the 85 flowers are filming ancient idol dramas again. Liu Shishi is also filming an ancient idol drama with a new male lead recently. This may be the problem faced by actresses in the entire entertainment industry. In recent years, the girl cult has emerged in the entertainment industry. First, Liu Xiaoqing played a girl, and then Zhang Wenli played an older idol drama. The 85 flowers in the entertainment industry have never been able to get rid of ancient idol dramas. To deal with this problem well, we must first get the whole environment right. Many people compare and belittle Tang Yan and Yu Shuxin's recent makeup. In fact, there is no need. After all, the age gap between the two is really there. Besides, why can't we appreciate both of them at the same time? I hope Tang Yan's new drama this time can make a shine. Thank you for watching the video. Please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel, 